Stooping to the steep ways of corporations, he bolsters numbers till the markets tear. Gazes above the hungry brothers' stare, who cannot shoulder lies or cause much strife. Sleeps in the street and hugs his injured life. Avarice climbs above the golden rule and tricks his psyche's jubilant young fool into pouring all his love down material drains without a thought for any of my strains, like live for others in everything you try. And fear will end, and death will only die. But, no, mechanization always invades, disrobes the mysteries knowledge steals on raids without considering the original story. The skins of its ripe themes are torn and gory. The kindly wisdom God put us here to gain, he maroons on dunes of means and renders vain, keeps buried with my never-ending leers, which haven't caught his rushing thoughts in years. He does not know he chose a dark alliance, or how to repossess lost innocence, nor will he let the shoreline of his ego erode or see beyond its clearest shallow. So his mental fabric frays from stress, and isolation comes with great success. He keeps the world beyond the compound gate to taste the freshest justifications for hate, gives up happiness to deny despair, and no amount of therapy makes him care. The empire of his heart builds up cement in opposition to the testament he never opens and sits down to read anymore, but which he assumes most heed. Theologies of power hold him enraptured because the airwaves say they are the standard. Because he wants to be the individual among conformists in the safe realm of normal. And the low, dishonest decades pass with youth while he keeps trying to make a towering truth from lies without a glimmer of success. <laughs> 